What's up everyone? Today I went to my LCS and picked up one box of the brand new 2018 Topps Stadium Club Baseball. I have been so excited for this product because every single year I refuse to buy a box. I don't know why, I absolutely love the base set. So this year I am going for the full base set. I am so excited to open this box. I've been waiting so long for this release day. So without further ado, let's get into it. Let me take off the plastic wrap before I show you the box here. But like I said, every year Stadium Club is one of my favorite products. It's not expensive, the cards look beautiful, I'm a big fan of photography and filmography and cinematography, so I love when baseball cards look beautiful, and Stadium Club does just that. They use amazing pictures, amazing photography, so finally I decided to buy a full box and actually go for the full base set. So here is the box right here, 2018 Topps Stadium Club Baseball. It says two on-card autograph cards in every box, so that's really cool for the price point. 16 packs, 8 cards per pack. You got your MLB hologram sticker there. The exclusive MLB trading cards, of course. Here's one side, Stadium Club Baseball 2018, two on-card autographs. Another side here. This side over here that says one insert or parallel card per pack. Another side there, and here is the back, which there are no odds on, so I'm assuming the odds will be on the back of the pack. Chris Bryant is the poster boy for Topps Stadium Club Baseball. And here we go. Looks beautiful, look at that. Nothing better than opening up a brand new box of cards on release day. Here's what it would look like on display at your local card store. Pick your pack, pick your poison, whatever you want. So here are the packs, they actually look different than the box. You've got Chris Bryant, the poster boy, again on the pack. It says Top Stadium Club Baseball 2018, eight trading cards per pack. And then here are your odds, so I'll show you that before we get into it. So there are the odds, might be hard to pick up, but if you wanna pause the video and check out those odds, then by all means, go right ahead. So without further ado, Let's get into it. First pack, 2018 Top Stadium Club. My first look. Let's see what we've got. So, first pack. Great picture right there of Zach Granite. Rookie for the Twins. He's an outfielder. Awesome catch. That's what I mean. Just here are the base cards. Look how beautiful. It's all photography, very light graphics. Just looks amazing. The back is great too. You've got stadium seating on the back for Stadium Club, of course. You've got a picture of them in the top left, their name in the top right, and you've got stats, which I love stats on the back of baseball cards. So this product is just a win. I'm going for the full base set, so let's hope I get most of them with this box. We've got Giancarlo Stanton for the Yankees. We've got Tyler Malley, rookie for the Reds. They're so beautiful. God, I love the artwork. Look at that, Mike Piazza on the Dodgers. Look at that, that photography is incredible. I love this set. We've got Garrett Richards. We've got a Bean Team Chris Bryant insert. Nice looking insert there. We've got a Kevin Kiermeyer. And we've got Cole Hamels possible trade target at the deadline. Just an awesome, awesome set. I am so excited for this box break. I'm glad I bought this box. Might buy more in the future, who knows? This product is awesome. We've got Jimmy Scherfe, rookie for the Diamondbacks. Just admire the photography. I know you all wanna see what hits I get, but that's not what I'm going after. I'm just looking at the cards, admiring them, so admire them with me. We've got Marwin Gonzalez. Beautiful pose right there. Nice load, nice leg kick, I like it. George Brett. It looks like there's one legend in each pack that's not a current player. I had Piazza in the last one, George Brett in this one. Nice card there. We've got Matt Carpenter. Could have used a better photo for that one, but still a very nice picture. 
We've got a Francisco Mejia red. I'm not sure what the red is, but a nice rookie for the Indians, Francisco Mejia, top catcher prospect. Let's see what that is actually. Is it numbered? It is not numbered. I'm assuming it's a short print. I have to do my research on the actual parallels, but as you see, Stadium Club is in red and Francisco Mejia is in red as well. The normal cards are in silver. So you've got silver name, silver Stadium Club, red. So that's pretty cool. I gotta look into the short print of that. We've got a Beam Team Reese Hoskins rookie card. That one's also red. The Chris Bryant was different. Is this numbered or no? I guess that's just another red parallel, so I'll have to learn the whole set here. But that's really nice. So the other Beam Team that I got was of this. It might just be based off of team color or it might be parallels, but the Stadium Club again is red foil, so it's probably a parallel, but that's the difference in those. So a nice Reese Hoskins rookie card. We've got Manny Margot diving for a catch. And we've got Hunter Pence striking out probably. <laughs> okay, pack number three. Oh, that's nice. Look at that right at the front. Shohei Otani rookie. That was when he was being announced on the Angels. That is a beauty. Look at that. Oh. Happy I got one of those. Shohei Otani, rookie. We've got Travis Shaw, hyped about a walk-off homer probably. He's a beast. Yoenis Cespedes, look at that. Oh my God, the photography is just wonderful. How do you not love this product? Look at that. Oh, I love that card. Oh man, that's great. We've got Garrett Cole on the Astros, of course. Having a heck of a season. Awesome picture. We've got a Special Forces insert of Bryce Harper. Cool looking picture there too, running the bases. We've got a Beam Team insert of Clint Frazier. Now this Stadium Club one is black. That's blacked out. So I'm not sure if that's numbered. Oh it is, 49 of 99 on the top right. Clint Frazier, 49 of 99 black insert parallel. Nice rookie insert out of 99. Really cool. Awesome. First numbered card. We've got Kenley Jansen. That's awesome. I love how they blurred out the other players and got him coming onto the mound. Pretty cool. Awesome picture there. And we've got Orlando Arcia for the Brewers. These are just awesome. I can't believe how cool these are. Look how beautiful the pictures are. Jeez. Okay. Pack number four. We've got a lot of packs, so this is probably going to be a long break, but I'm going to enjoy this one thoroughly because honestly, I don't care about what autographs I get. Now that sounds crazy. You pay an amount of money for a product and you want to get your money back at least or return on investment. But with this product, I absolutely love the look of these cards. I want to build the base set. So I really don't care what my autographs are. I think this product is worth it. It's a cheaper product. You get what you're given and I love it. So I'm truly going to enjoy this break. I'm going to take my time with it and look at all of the beautiful photography. So first off, we've got Daryl Strawberry for my Mets. Love it. Nice legend picture there. Carlos Santana for the Phillies. Trevor Story, questioning why he struck out looking for the 200th time. Justin Upton on the Angels. We've got a Alex Mejia rookie for the Cardinals, and that's red foil. Alex Mejia. We've got Lucas Giolito. He's been a very disappointing prospect his whole career now. Just hasn't turned it around. We got Mike Clevenger, that's an awesome picture. Talking to, I believe his name is Perez. Roberto Perez or something along those lines. Really cool picture. And John Gray with the man bun. He's rocking the man bun on the mound. Let those locks flow, man. Okay, pack number five. We've got J.D. Davis rookie for the Astros, Ryan McMahon rookie for the Rockies, 
Jackie Bradley Jr. Cool picture there. Michael Fulmer leaving the mound after a disappointing outing. We've got a special forces insert of Joey Votto. We've got a Josh Donaldson with his injured calf that he's somehow bending for. Marcus Stroman, that is awesome. Look at that picture. How do you not love these cards? I'll say it again and again and again. Look how beautiful that card looks, wow. And Daniel Murphy, ex-Met. Pack six, I believe. There are 16 packs total, so we are not even halfway done yet. Reggie Jackson. Tommy Pham. Sandy Alcantara, rookie for the Marlins. He was involved in the Ozuna trade. Sean Manaya threw a no-hitter this season. Jose Abreu might make the all-star team as a starting first baseman for the AL. That's exciting. We've got a never-compromise insert of Jose Altuve. That's a cool insert as well. We've got Evan Longoria on the Giants. And we've got D. Gordon on the Mariners. Nice picture there too. This set is amazing. Next pack. We haven't seen one of the autographs yet, so still got two to look forward to. We've got Felix Jorge, Twins rookie. Zach Cozart. Trey Mancini. We've got a Don Mattingly, that's nice. Donnie Baseball. A Nico Goodrum rookie card for the Tigers. Another red foil, we got Domingo Santana for the Brewers. Ryan Braun for the Brewers, sliding in home. And we've got Eddie Rosario, who's having a monster season this year for the Twins. And he's taking pictures. He's the one taking the pictures for Stadium Club. Look at that. Now we know the excellent photographer. Eddie, if you are done with baseball, take up photography. Stadium Club finest. Here we go. Next pack. The packs are not opening very nicely, though. Having a lot of pack issues. We've got an Andrew Stevenson rookie for the Nationals. Chris Davis. There's a lot of funny things with Chris Davis. They put his face on a bus so it won't hit anything. Every time he gets a hit, a bar in Baltimore gives out free shots. So it's pretty funny. Chris Davis is having a very weird season. Eric Hosmer on the Padres. Very cool. We've got Chris Bryant. Nice. The Stadium Club boy. And look, that same image is on the pack. Look at that. Chris Bryant on the pack, same as the card. Ian Kinsler. A never compromised Mark McGuire. Pat Neshek, fellow card collector. Shout out to you. And Nick Castellanos of the Tigers. All right, we're halfway through the box now. I believe this is pack number eight or nine. No autographs yet, so I like when it's towards the end. We've got Ozzy Smith, legend, the wizard. Kyle Schwarber, that's an awesome picture. Saluting the crowd. Tipping his cap. Runette Odor. We got a shiny card coming up, I think. Jorge Alfaro for the Phillies. 
We've got a red foil Jake Arietta for the Phillies. Nice red foil. And we've got a chrome card of Byron Buxton. Look at that. That is really, really cool. So the chrome cards are not numbered, I believe. They are just one per box. So there's Byron Buxton. There's the back of it, not numbered, but it's got that chrome foiling on it. Looks really cool. Reminds me of the older cards of Stadium Club. So it says Stadium Club Chrome in the top left, actually. Pretty cool. I believe the one of one of those are gold. We've got Ryan Zimmerman hitting a walk-off, I presume. And Steven Strasburg. Nice picture there. I love that. You see the ball coming towards you and everything. That's beautiful. Too bad he's injured. He's a heck of a pitcher as well. What a picture. Okay, moving on. Next pack. Let's see what we get. So we start off with a Francisco Mejia rookie. We've gotten that one before. I like seeing new guys because I'm going for the base set. So I have the red foil of him though. So that's the first one of the normal version. Same with Domingo Santana. I have a red foil of him. Now I have the normal version. It's good. I just want to put together an actual base set. So Mike fulton having a great season for the Braves. The Braves are having a great season in general. Rizal Iglesias, closer for the Reds. Whit Merrifield, and that is a black, so I believe this will be numbered to 99. Whit Merrifield, black parallel, let's see. Not numbered to 99, I guess just the insert is, but this one is black, so it's probably short printed. So you see the black stadium club in the top, and his name is in black as well. So that is probably a short print. We've got Nelson Cruz. Nice picture there of the boom stick. Mitch Hanniger. Great photo there. He's having a heck of a season as well. And we've got Yadier Molina. Tagging out Joey Votto at the plate. That's an awesome picture. Yadi is one heck of a catcher. Okay, moving on. Still haven't seen one autograph yet. And we're 0 to 2, so. We've got Bo Jackson. Look at that. That's an awesome card. Bo knows. Yuli Guriel running around the bases. Adam Duvall crushing a homer. Edwin Encarnacion contemplating if it's hot outside and if he wants to do good. Oh, cool. We've got a members only stamp of Paul DeYoung. I don't know what the members only is. It's a short print, I know, but I don't think it's numbered. But that's really cool. Members only of Paul DeYoung. Members only stadium club. So that's the back. Same as the normal ones. No numbering. But members only. You got that stamp right there. Really cool. That's a cool one. Okay. We got Jay Bruce. It would be nice if he was healthy and doing well, but I like the home run apple in the back. Brett Gardner, smiling at his team because he's old and the rest of them are under 20. And Matt Chapman, nice play there. You can see the ball going right into the glove. All right, we got five packs to go, two autos remain. We've gotten one numbered card, one members only card, and a few short prints. So this is going very, very well. Hopefully you've put together most of the base set. We've got Troy Scribner, rookie. Jose Ramirez, having a heck of a season as well. Jackson Stevens, rookie for the Reds. Kenta Maeda, that's a cool picture too. Lewis Brinson of the Marlins. We've got a Wade Boggs Black. Nice black parallel for the Red Sox. Lance McCullers, that is awesome. One of my favorite base cards so far. That looks so sick. 
the crowd going nuts in the background. Lance McCullers hyped up. That picture is wonderful. Great card right there. I love it. That's a great one. And Salvador Perez, another great one. Look at that. Flexing on him with the smile. I love it. Okay, four packs remain. No autos found yet. And these packs are still giving me a problem. There we go. All right, so we've got Julio Urias leading us off. Dodgers prospect. Jen Ho Zhang, rookie for the Cubs. Bryce Harper, that's a nice one. Also a new one as well. We're almost done with the box and we're still finding new base cards, which is awesome. Nice picture there, Archie Bradley. That is cool. Carlos Rodon. That's cool, power zone insert of Anthony Rizzo. I'm assuming those are autographed as well, which would be really cool if you had an autograph right there. Power zone insert of Anthony Rizzo. Brad Ziegler. Submariner. And we've got a Garrett Cooper rookie for the Marlins, ex-Yankee. Three packs to go, no autographs have been found. I'm starting to get a little worried. Starting to get a little worried here. All right, we got a thicker card here. I'm assuming that will be an autograph. We've got a Chance Cisco rookie card for the Orioles. We've got a nice Alex Mejia rookie. I believe we have one of these already, but it might have been a parallel for the Cardinals. We've got a Jonathan Scope for the Orioles. We've got a Taiwan Walker for the Diamondbacks. Cool picture there, too. And we've got a red Sandy Alcantara. Good thing I already have his base. Red foil Alcantara. And our first autograph is Jimmy Scherfe. A rookie auto of Jimmy Scherfe of the Diamondbacks. His auto is really nice. I'm not sure how good he is, but that is a very beautiful auto. Way to go, Jimmy. Keep that auto clean. Very nice. We've got Carlos Martinez asking, really, you use this photo for my stadium club picture? And you've got Dexter Fowler. That's cool. It says home run on the back, walk off homer. That's pretty cool. All right, we still haven't seen a Trout base card, a Cindergaard base card, or DeGrom base card. I'm not sure if they have base in this product, but I'm assuming Trout would, right? All right, two packs remain, one auto remains. Will it be in the last pack? Who knows? We've got Dennis Eckersley. Nice legend there. George Springer, your World Series MVP. Cameron Mabin for the Marlins. Kyle Seeger, that's a cool picture. We've got a power zone of Chris Bryant. So we got a Chris Bryant and Anthony Rizzo. Wish there was ink on both of those. That would have been nuts. We've got a Josh Harrison, a Josh Bell, and Gregory Polanco. That's a cool photo too. All right, last pack of the break. One auto remains, wish me luck. Let's see what we get. All right, there's two thick cards in here, so we should have an auto. Here we go. Miguel Sano. Nicky Delmonico, rookie for the White Sox. Nomar Mazzara for the Rangers. Felix Hernandez, King Felix. Cool picture there with the K's in the background. A Chance Cisco Red Foil rookie. And our last autograph of the break. Oh, that's cool looking. Corey Mella, rookie card. I've never heard of this guy either. I've never even seen him in the majors. Corey Mella, rookie. Really cool looking autograph, but don't know him. So our two autographs were two pretty unknown rookies, but it's okay, like I said, not going for the autographs really. It would have been nice to get a good guy, but you get what you're given. So we got Curry Mella and Jimmy Scherfe as the autos. 
And our last two cards are Yasiel Puig with an awesome, awesome photo. Wow, that's cool. Tongue out and everything. And Jock Peterson. So wow, no Trout, no DeGrom, no Syndergaard. I didn't get many Mets either. I think I just got Cespedes. So that is all for the break. Just a quick recap. We got the Jimmy Scherfe and the Curie Mella rookie autos. We got a Clint Frazier out of 99 insert, which was really cool. We got a members only card of Paul DeYoung. We got a Shohei Otani rookie, and we got a lot of short prints. So that is all for this break. I had a lot of fun. I was so excited to open this box. I really love this set. I can't wait to put together the whole base set. The photography is beautiful. I definitely recommend this to younger collectors or people who appreciate art and baseball in general. Just a beautifully crafted card, beautiful photography. Everything goes for this product. It's cheap. It's fun. I definitely recommend it. But with that being said, that is all for this break. I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure you give this video a like if you did, subscribe for more content, and also you can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snups at Cardicidal, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later, everyone.